where did you go? I wanted to thank you. Oh, good gravy! That is so unsanitary! Do we have any cleaning supplies left in the closet? Ah, uh, son, please. Oh, it's so good to see you boys again! <laughs> missed you too, Chica. Oh, before I get distracted, have you seen a sweet little girl around? Cassie? Who's that? Yes, Cassie! She was one of Roxanne's girls. She actually helped get my voice box back about an hour or so ago. But my power cell's been acting up. And now this power at random. I wanted to thank her, but also ask what the absolute heck a girl like her is doing here. Everything's a mess, and I can't see more than three feet ahead of me. Most of my memory is hazy and fuzzy, and so I, I'm really at a loss. But it's too dangerous for her if she's still wandering about. An hour, an hour ago? Cassie still being here means... She's been here for hours. We have to find her. And we will. We just need to figure out where to start. She could be anywhere inside the pizza plex. Chica. Try to make your way to the daycare and we'll help you repair your power cell when we get back. <clears throat> oh, gosh. Everything is such a mess. I can't orient myself as well as I used to. Hmm. Any ideas where we might be? Well, there are a lot of arcade cabinets. Hmm. Do you realize how little that narrows it down? Yeah. Yeah. Um, I don't really know. Oh, this place must have been flooded with families. It must have been so full of life. I can't wait till Fazbear Entertainment has this place open and new once more. Then everyone can be so happy again. Yeah. That'll be the day. And it will be amazing with all of us together. I know we can. I can feel the others calling out to us. We can help! We will find them! Yes! Yes, you're right! We will find them! <laughs> uh, is this area collapsing? N no, I don't think so. Mm -hmm. Huh? What on earth was that? Is someone there? Uh, please, I need help. DJ? DJ? Thank heavens, I thought I was all alone. Oh, my little Luna Moth, how wonderful it is to see your sweet face again. Oh, DJ, oh god, DJ. Where is my sweet little common son, hmm? He's here. We're all here, DJ. We're here for you. I thought everyone had forgotten about me. No, never. M may I see the sweet little ray of sunshine? Of course you may. Hello, DJ, I... I, I I'm sorry. I can't see as good as Moon in the Dark. Oh, my sweet little Citrus. It's alright. It is still an absolute delight to see your bright and sunny features again. Oh, DJ. How are we supposed to get him out of here? I'm not sure, actually. Have you tried pulling those slabs off you? Oh, I've tried. But either I can't grip the slab well enough, or I worry if I somehow displace it, I'll end up crushing something even... More vital, or breaking myself into unmovable condition. I, uh, see. Not really, but I'm sure we'll think of something. <laughs> um, we can try to toss ideas of how to release DJ from the rubble. That could work. Whichever shall I do, I must be the luckiest arachnid around. A sweet cosmos all to myself. Oh my. Maybe we could use our tether. Son, you see those beams on the ceiling? Mm, no. Um, my goodness, son. Mm, sorry. So I was thinking if we use the tether, loop it around the beam for extra leverage, <laughs> we can <laughs> safely remove <laughs> the slabs from DJ. I am... I'm not too sure the beam, let alone our tether, could support that weight anymore. It's all completely deteriorating and could snap, or worse, bring down more rubble onto DJ. Hmm, 
That is a valid concern. If we had enough force, we could still push them off him. We could go for the others while we still look for Cassie. I don't want to leave him alone up here, though. I don't want to leave him alone either. But I don't know what else we can do. Oh, I might have an idea. It's just a small idea. Why we go throughout the Plex? Oh? I think TJ's happy. <laughs> Definitely. Hello, little friend. I desperately apologize I cannot offer you any music at this time, but you, my little marshmallow peep, are deeply appreciated, you cute little fella. Come on, we should get moving before we're missed. Oh. I know, but once we find the others, it will be much safer. I know. I just hope the others are okay. After some confusing vent scurrying, come on. <clears throat> Of course, the one vent we can access to here is blocked. Come on, Moon! Suck it in! Suck what? We don't have anything to suck. Moon! Moon! Are you okay? Yeah, I'm alright. Just a bit winded. Um, Moon? Yeah. D don't move! The water in front of us, it's electrified. What? Uh, oh my gosh! How, how did we not fall in that? Oh gosh. Is there a way we can get back from where we came? Moon? 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 Are you hurt? Let me check. <clears throat> nope. Hmm? Moon, what's that? <clears throat> help. Help me, Vernon. Please, Bernie, please, please, help me! Oh, God. Moon! Monty, he's... Moon? We can't. Moon, can you hear me? So much pain, we have to... Please, Moon, focus! Oh, dear God. Grinding. Sun? Burning. Moon's not responding! Do something. Don't worry, uh, I'll take care of it. Anything. I'm sorry, I couldn't... It's all right, Moon. You're okay. Shh, breathe. It's all right. Please, I'm sorry. It's all right. You're all right. <sighs> oh my. How can we get him out of there? Perhaps I could maybe find something to drag him out. But if there's nothing around, something not conductive, something sturdy. Uh, I know. <clears throat> Eclipse? What are you doing? You'll see. I just have to hurry. Uh, okay. We believe in you! Ugh. Uh, uh, it burns! Uh. You got him! Oh, thank goodness! Uh, let's pull him out. Hurry, Eclipse! Yes, I'm going. 